everyone, it's BMA, it's a me, BMA, double OG, and welcome back to another episode of, of Let's Play Minecraft on 1.19 slash 1.20 series. Um, so, anyways guys, we are still on 1.19.3, because we haven't updated to 1.20, so this might be the last episode before we go to the, to the, uh, to the new update, and of course we're going to be going to the new biome and going to get the armor trims as well so yeah welcome back so so t so in this episode i do want to do some preparations before for uh 1.20 as well as i might work on in inside the mega build as well yeah i do want to i do want to work on the inside of the mega build as well but yeah, we're gonna get things for 1.20. So I do want to build a bamboo farm. Yes, we're gonna need a bamboo farm for the new blocks in 1.20. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and build a farm for that. And I'm gonna go get the supplies for it and be right back. Okay, guys, I'm over here at the uh, Badlands biome. Yeah, this is where I'm gonna be mining a bunch of terracotta throughout the series. As you probably guess right now. <laughs> I came over here because I wanted to mine some terracotta. Because, you know what? I decided to use some terracotta. And also, I forgot to mention. Yes, I do have that terracotta um, data pack. Where I can use any terracotta color, colors. What, what I need. Or what color I need. As long as I use dye with any... Uh, terracotta or any of the other colored terracotta that I don't want. So yeah, <laughs> and I set my beacon here. And yes, I use diamonds. <laughs> of course I use diamonds. I mean, I do have a stack of diamond blocks at least, so I decided to take some. And we're going to need to get a whole ton of diamonds for 1.20, especially if we're going to make a bunch of templates because they're going to cost seven diamonds each. Ugh. That's what I don't like about it, is that diamonds are now going to be expensive to do now. But, oh well guys, but, but anyways guys, I'm going to go ahead and mine a bunch of terracotta and I'll meet you guys back at the base. Okay guys, I'm back after that whole mining with the terracotta. Um, yep, as you can see, all the terracotta is placed in here. Oh uh, yeah, that is a lot. We got a lot of terracotta now. So yeah, um, so we're actually gonna, I'm actually gonna make these into probably some different colors, and I might smelt these into the glazed terracotta, as I hardly use, I don't think I haven't used a single glazed terracotta yet, and I, I've been thinking about that for a while. So who knows, guys, I might actually use some glazed terracotta, but yeah, guys, so anyways, I'm going to see you all back, I, actually, no, 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 no. Now, actually, while I was out there, I killed a spider, and I got myself a spider head, which is probably the re most rarest head in the more mob head data pack, um, if I recall, because I remember these being more rare than the cave spiders, and I somehow got one, and now I have it. <laughs> and you're probably wondering what I'm going to do with all these heads. Will I make a headroom in this base? Yes. Yes, I will. I will make a headroom. But I'm actually going to expand this base here soon. But we're not going to do that yet until much later. Because there's a lot more stuff I want I want to do before I start doing that. So I'm going to... So anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and smelt some, some of these terracotta. And I'll see you all over at the industrial island. Alright, guys. I'm back after... After getting some supplies for this bamboo farm, I decided to build it right here, right next to the cocoa bean farm and the melon and pumpkin farm. Yeah, I decided to build right here. And as you can see, I'm actually going to build all of this around. Yep. Yep. All of this is going to go around, as you can see. So, yeah, the pistons will be going here. And this is where. And also, this is where I'm going to set so many. I'm going to set one observer up on each of these uh, four corners of the pistons. Just so, just so we can get a lot more bamboo uh, either way. 
Also, all right, guys, I got the observers in and the pistons in. As you can see, we're going with this style of the bamboo farm. Um, of course, we're going to be building around it so we can make the build look nice. And of course, that's why we have the bottom here as well, because I plan on doing something on this bottom right here. Well, you're going to find out and see. So, yeah, we're. So, yeah. We got the redstone to place, and then I'm probably gonna go get the bamboo and start growing. And then we'll set up our collection set stuff. Alright, guys, I got the redstone in, and everything seems to look uh, pretty sad uh, for the bamboo farm. So I will be, I will be building the uh, storage here as well. If I'm gonna put lime, I'm gonna put lime glazed terracotta underneath these pistons because I thought that would, they would look cool with the bamboo uh, growing here. So yeah, I'm gonna go with this style, the bamboo with the uh, lime terracotta because I went and smelt some of it because I went to, uh, to the Badlands to get some. Alright, man. Alright. Alright, guys, I got the hoppers in place. Yeah, I split the rails all around here. Yep, the minecart hopper is in place. As you can see, it's all good. Yep, it's going all around. So you probably notice I'm digging a little bit down here. Yeah, I'm actually digging down here. I don't know where to put the storage. I was actually gonna put it up there, but no, I let's put it under here. Yes, I'm back, and as you can see, as you can see, the uh, I set up a little storage for now, but this might not be the basic storage. This might be a basic storage system, but for the bamboo, because it's in this place right here. Um, so yeah, this might be it, but I'm planning on expanding more of the storage. I might do it later on, who knows, because I do want to get more supplies. And we're also, we're going to need a lot more hoppers than I think, so... I know I'm going to need to make an iron farm here soon. I need to. I need to make an iron farm. That's my problem. Alright. Yeah, we're going to, um, we're actually going to build around this for next. We're actually going to build around this, guys. So, um, I brought some glowstone with me uh, for lighting. And also, I'm using the green glazed terracotta to cover this whole thing. Uh, the, so, yeah, this uh, this uh, farm will be able to be lightable just like over at the... Uh... Alright, guys, I got the bamboo all set up. Yeah, as you can see, it's all good. And we'll, we'll do something about down here and possibly build a roof up here as well because I do want to make this uh, a little bit more nicer and also we're going to add in a little bit more industrial into this build so so yeah we're, we're got, we are going to go ahead and do that so yeah we got well as you can see the bamboo is coming into these chests and that's about it yep so this uh the storage is gonna fill up but like, i don't know how that quick because i don't have hoppers all the way go all the way around here that's why <laughs> that's why the minecart is gonna pick up a lot by a time all right guys i'm back after a few days later because i kind of stopped after a while because i took a break um so I went with this idea. As you can see, um, the bamboo farm is finished. It's actually going right now. As you can see here in the middle, I put glass here. And basically, yep, the bamboo is all here in the spot. But we are going to make this a like, very awesome build. As you can see, we're, we're actually going to expand it upwards. Um, so I'm using lime concrete uh, because the lime concrete is actually closer to the, uh, the bamboo than... The normal regular green but I put some green glazed terracotta to to make it more nice so you know how i did it i went with this idea right here um yeah it's basically like this and also we're going to be expanding it upwards like this 
yeah, like this. We'll be going to the sides as well. So, yeah, so yeah, guys, we got this under the bag. <laughs> All right, guys, uh, while I was working on the building, I kind of ran out of material, so I had to come back to the base to get smelt some uh, more glazed terracotta. And I decided to go play around with my lays here. And I started breeding them, and as well as, finally, I got in the lay head. Oh, man. <laughs> Do I look awesome with this head on? Because it, it really matches my uh, my skin really well. Man. Yeah, because these guys are my... F these guys, I love them so much. And <laughs> and I feel like I transformed into, in a way, <laughs> into them. Oh, yeah. But these guys are awesome. I've been breeding them. I've been trying to kill them so I can get their head. Alright, I got it. And you know what? I probably might wear this the rest of the episode. Who knows? Alright, right, guys. I got this room a little nice, as you can see. Look at that. Look at this room. It's all... It's all clear up. And it's also lit with glowstone here in the middle. Yep, we got glowstone here. Um... I might put a piece of glowstone right there, so it, it lights up pretty good. So, yeah, basically all the bamboo will be coming in these chests, and now I'll probably put a crafting table here when we update to 1.20 as well. And yes, I'm going to build a wall back there, don't worry, I will deal with that hole back there. Alright guys, I went with this uh, design right here with the bamboo, and honestly, I think it looks better with the, uh, the whole greenish here. Oh yeah, so I put these bamboos here because of that, and I thought it would look amazing. So yeah, we got that all out of the way. So we're basically all—I'm basically all done with this project. And yes, we're gonna build a ceiling out of that, so don't worry about that. Um, and also I might—and also I might come through here and decorate this. I might do it on a live stream. Who knows? I might do this on a live stream. As well as, I do want to do some more projects in the live stream as well. Um, maybe tidy some things up over here on the industrial island. And also, I might, and also I might upgrade the flow this uh, flower farm right here, just so I can, just so I can have like a hopper system that go that can put the bone meal into it and then not get activated by the redstone. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm gonna do that on the live stream as well. And also, and also do some tidy thumps, uh, tidy things around here. Huh, might make a barn actually for these moose rooms because they've been out here for quite some time and I haven't been using them. The only thing I've been farming them for is to get leather. And I'm not really into the steak since I'm really into the golden carrots now. So yeah. Anyway, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna see you all back. I'm gonna move all my stuff back to the storage and all. See y'all back. Alright, all right, guys, I'm back after I I took all my stuff and put them back in my storage room. So, yeah, I'm over here in my storage room, actually, because there's actually something else I need to bring up. So, in 1.20, yes, well, there's going to be a lot of changes. As well as, a lot of changes to netherite to, to turn diamond armor into netherite. Yes, there's a change in 1.20 with netherite. Because the smithing table is going to be uh, different in 1.20. Because now in 1.20 we're going to we're going to need a template in order to upgrade our diamond armor or tools to netherite armor. So uh, to netherite tools and armor. So so yeah we're so yeah so they did change the netherite upgrade system. So we're going to need to go get a template in order to get a netherite upgrade again. So, I think I should work on this right now. I mean, I still have, I still have quite a few arm, a few armor from, um, from raiding a bunch of end cities, as you can see. Um, I also took iron tools from it as well. I did, but I did want to check how my netherite tools and armor. T tools and armor are doing. I mean, this is the only netherite set I have. I should probably make another set before uh, I update to 1.20.
Um, I probably might do that off screen, but I just wanted to let y'all know that Netherite um, upgrading is going to be a little different in 1.20. And so, yeah, I actually did win Netherite hunting. I got like 48. I almost have a stack of debris. Man, I really, and I really want to go ahead and get a lot more of this because I might use the ancient debris as something because this is a, this is a resistible block. Yeah, to TNT. Yeah, and I do want to test out with this with this block if I wanted to do like a TNT cannon or something. If I need something to blow up. And also another thing, yes, we're gonna need a ton of diamonds in order in order to make um, some extra templates. Because after when you find one, you can just you have to use seven diamonds. As well as the block that represents the crafting recipe, um, and also a and the template itself. It basically, so basically, you're only getting one template each time when you craft it. So it's gonna take a lot of diamonds to do it. And I'm kind of glad they made diamonds uh, something useful besides making a shoot box or tools and armor. I mean, after we can get villagers, diamonds are basically useless to you, except make them into like a indecorable block. Um, I still have a stack of deep slate diamond ore. I might go mining some more deep slate diamond ore, because I might get a lot, a lot more stacks of them. Okay, guys, I'm over here at the uh, Rainbow Skylight Island dome. Um, as you can see, last time we, uh, we finished this build, and I do want to work on the inside, a little bit on the inside this episode. So the first thing I want to do is I'm actually going to build a little storage house right now. So I'm going to build a little storage house, and I'm going to build it up there, where I set a bunch of, uh, pink pill, a pink pillar down. <laughs> I mean, what's with me using co different colors of concrete? I mean... I don't know. But <laughs> All right, guys, I'm back over at the, uh, the place. And this is the materials I want to go with. <laughs> yeah, some black stone, some end stone, stone, some cobble deep slate, and some tough, and some obsidian, as well as some stairs. And we'll probably include some slabs as well. So, yeah, we're going to we're going to do that. So, I'm going to I'm going to start with stone right now cuz I do want to show off some all right, guys, I'm back on something uh, while I was building. Um, <laughs> oh, I did lie in the last episode that I would be safe from Phantom. No, I'm not. Phantom can still spawn in here, and I know it. It sucks. It sucks. They can still spawn even through glass. Like, they can still spawn through glass. Since uh, my project is called the Skylight Island, and that's why it's called that. That's why the phantoms are in. Uh, I know it's kind of annoying. All right, guys, I'm back, and as you can see, I, I built this whole thing up. Yep, it's like a mixture of stone, cobble, deep slate, and tough blocks up there. And so you probably think that's gonna be the storage house. No, it's not gonna be that. <laughs> I built this obsidian platform right here. Yep, the obsidian platform is right here. Huh. All right, guys, I'm back after this building. And as you can see, um, I went with this cool column right here. And honestly, I think it looks very good. I decided to use the deep slate uh, polish, the polished deep slate and the deep slate bricks. And honestly, it looks better together. It looks awesome with that stone up there. So, Honestly, this storage house is all, is all done. It's all done, as you can see. Yeah, the ceiling's all cool. And also, this whole thing. So, I hope you guys really like the build. Yeah, because I'm taking building... Because I'm actually taking building to the next level. Because pretty soon I want to do... I want to do some pretty good um, building styles. Uh, here with these uh, with these blocks and other stuff. And, and just uh, make a build. So yeah, so yeah, this is where I'm gonna store like a bunch of building blocks and stuff uh, for for projects inside of this um this uh, place. 
So yeah, and honestly, that platform right there, that will be that will probably be the basement of the storage house. So it'll it'll expand upon what storage I wanted to go for. And yeah, I really think this, I really think this looks good and it looks awesome. Oh yeah, also, uh, off screen I went and did the Nether portals. I actually did not go into the Nether yet on this portal, so I will need to work. I will need to. Make like a, a little tunnel to this uh, portal in the nether as well. So, yeah, the build is it's all good. And I hope you guys like it. And this is probably the last thing I'm going to do this episode. So, so hope, anyway, so that's all I'm going to do this episode. I hope you guys like that bamboo build and as well as that storage house build as well. And also, be, I'm talking about like 1.20 stuff and then... So I'm pretty sure next episode we're gonna do the 1.20 stuff. Yep. So we'll be updating the 1.20. So anyways guys, I hope you guys like this episode and remember to leave a like on the episode and go and subscribe to my channel as well. As well as as well as if you have Discord, you should join my YouTube and Twitch Discord server. Uh, the link will be down in the description down below. And yeah, also go follow me on Twitch as well because we're gonna return to live streams here soon. So anyways guys, I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye.